I got the opportunity to apply for a grant to start an educational initiative. So my idea was to start an educational center in Dulugu, which is a community that most people don't have access to electricity, resources, and quality teachers. So I started this initiative by applying for a grant, having to talk to community members, getting my teams together, and then in January 5th, that was this year, 2019, I was able to commission my project, which is now up running with over 13 volunteers. I won the Teacher Chain Maker Grant, which for that project, I want to run a sustainable um, sanitary pad project. And that project is um, to teach girls to make reusable sanitary pads. And these are girls in remote parts of Ghana. And we believe that Teaching them to make reusable pad, they will not keep coming back um, each time they need pad because they will learn how to make it for themselves. And this is pad they can use for over a year if um, they take very um, good care of it. We'll also be teaching them to make liquid soap and giving them other business ideas because these are girls who need to find a way to fend for themselves and to start their own small businesses. I am a youth change maker and how they all got into the youth change maker program? I met Miss Kat when I was in the African Science Academy. Then we were given the opportunity to apply to Reading Sports, which is now a sport, to apply for a grant of £1,000 to set up uh, educational facilities in our for various communities. So I volunteered to apply for that grant. Then I was given, I was given that £1,000. So I used it to establish an educational center in Bimbla, where it is open for everyone to come and learn and also inspire others from their community. I won a grant of 5,000 Ghana cities to set up a reading sport for my community. And since this reading sport has set up, since then there's been a change in my community. Anybody of any tribe, of any cultural background can come in and read and go out. And we have a whole lot of activities for uh, beneficiaries at my community and it's helping a lot. It has increased the BC uh, uh, rank of the school and then it is giving a whole lot of benefits to people around my community. 